This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming in. Live from TFNet headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 3 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday, final hour of the trading re week, and we got green across the board. S&P's trading up 16 points at 2908. Today, the first day, S&P's been over 2900 since October of last year. NASDAQ up 26 points, trading at, excuse me, yes, NASDAQ up 26 points, trading 7975, and the Dow up 230 points, trading 26,373. Notes and bonds, lower price, higher yield 10-year note negative 15 ticks 12303 30-year bond negative 26 ticks 14629 and the dollar index negative 209 ticks had been down as much as 400 ticks at one point trading 96 600 gold basically flat at 1294 and we got oil up 29 cents at 6387 we'll start things off let's take a look at the futures markets final hour until we hit that closing bell at four o'clock dow 30 it's been a pretty tame day all things considered you're talking about only about a hundred point trading range from the swing high to the swing low and we're sitting right in the middle of that range currently looking at the June futures contract for the Dow trading 26,376 NASDAQ 100 much the same in terms of right in the middle of the range we had a high in the NASDAQ 100 of 76.63 we trade down about 40 points to 76.18 back up in the middle of that range S&P's not quite as big of a range, but in the middle nonetheless, we make a high early this morning, 29.14. We trade down to a low of 29.02. Haven't gone below that 2,900 price point all day. It'll be interesting to see in this last hour if we can stay above that level, 29.07 in the S&P's. Crude with some volatility for sure, though. Backing things up to yesterday, quite a decline. We go even from Wednesday at 1 o'clock, trading at 64.59. We back it up to yesterday, middle of the day, 63.31. We get back up to 64.60, and then quite a sell-off. Even in the last hour, we just traded from 64.28 down to 63.85. Gold contract bouncing around as well. Couldn't quite get up to 1300 That is yesterday's action, of course, trading lower. Today, spiked to 1299 almost on a couple occasions. Made it there at 5.50 a.m. Eastern Time. We have gold trading at 1294.41. And euro trading at 112.29. Had been as high as, excuse me, yeah, 112, 112.96. Had been as high as 113.21. Stay tuned, folks. I'm going to be guest hosting for Tom coming up at 3 o'clock. we got our man Dave White for the Tech Insider segment at 3.30. Stay tuned. Be right back.